Everything you need to know about the Pisces in your life. Pisces are the dreamers of the zodiac. They are sensitive, artistic souls who always have a creative outlet they are talented at. Some people may think they are weak for being so vulnerable, but the Pisces sees this as a strength, they wouldn't want to live any other way. Summary Pisces Dates February 18th to March 20th Pisces Sign Fish Pisces Ruling Planet Jupiter Pisces Zodiac Quality Pisces Element Water Pisces Positive Traits Artistic, Loving, Deep Pisces Negative Traits Overly Sensitive, Lazy, Pessimistic Pisces Personality Traits A Pisces is considered to be the most highly evolved sign out of the whole zodiac. They symbolize the human soul, and they have a very deep belief in the universe. A Pisces swims freely in society, and represents the capacity to see the depths of life. They are completely fine with being drowned in the deep end of the world's emotions, and offerings, and are not afraid to simply feel. There is a dreamy, spiritual and deeply emotional quality to every Pisces. And resounding sensitivity, can make it difficult for these people, to lead an easy social life. They are often characterized, as the sign of sorrows, for they feel so much, and don't often fit in anywhere. They can be vulnerable to depression, and occasionally self-pity and insecurity overcomes them. Pisces are also known for using escapism in the form of drugs, to enter into their dream worlds, and forget about their woes. Their deep, and complex emotional life makes them highly attractive to those, who hold within them a thirst to learn more about opening themselves up. Piscians can be very generous, and are highly empathic when it comes to the difficulties of others, and they tend to act with compassion in the face of misfortune. Pisces Compatibility A Pisces is dreamy, and empathetic. They are sensitive, indecisive, and in need of affection. A Pisces needs to find a partner that will nurture their unique approach to relationships. They will need to commit to someone, who will be able to brighten them up when they get in their heads. A Pisces will always find a great partner in someone, who will accept and appreciate their love, for it is so rare and needs to be protected. A Scorpio will do just that, falling in love with how a Pisces meets their depths perfectly. Pisces Compatibility Chart Pisces and Aries Compatibility This combination isn't the strongest, as they struggle in communication. A Pisces might drop hints about what they want and need but they will never straight up say it. An Aries needs that clarity, which they don't get. In a relationship with a Pisces one has to be able to read, people very well but with an Aries they seem to overlook that. This couple fails, because each person just can't figure out or fake being what the other person needs. Pisces and Taurus compatibility, this is a wonderful match pairing a dreamer, Pisces, with a realist, Taurus. They both prefer a laid-back lifestyle, and know the other person needs to be supported and loved. They will have one of the happiest home lives, and be a couple with an unshakable bond. Pisces and Gemini Compatibility Gemini plus Pisces balance each other out very well. While a Pisces is very emotional and deep a Gemini is very compassionate, and understanding of their needs. A Pisces has no shame in being exactly, who they are and following how they feel, while a Gemini tends to play the role of, what someone needs them to be and makes the choices that seem logical. What each side needs the other seems to be. Pisces and Cancer Compatibility Cancer and Pisces will fundamentally understand each other, but they're so similar that they will have a hard time functioning in the real world, as a couple. Both of these signs work best, when they're paired with a sturdier person who lives in the real world, not another dreamer. This point aside, they will be perfectly happy together, and will create a beautiful, creative world, where everyone is nice to each other, and in the world is made up of art. Pisces and Leo Compatibility In this relationship the Leo has to be the strong and stable one. Pisces are very needy in relationships. Because everything is a Pisces life is based, on how they feel t. Hey need a partner, who understands and can nurture that. Where a Pisces might lack confidence, a Leo always is the confident one. Where a Pisces might crumble a Leo has no problem being their strength. This couple is good together, when each person understands the role they play, but problems occur most the time, when being the strong one becomes too much for a Leo. Pisces and Virgo Compatibility This combination is the relationship every parent wants their kids to be in. 
It's a practical relationship, down-to-earth, and productive duo. While it might not be that love story that keeps you up at night, they are the love you know will be loyal and someone, who will keep their vows if ever you choose each other. Pisces and Libra Compatibility, this pair is one of the strongest. Their loyalty to one another, is what is so great. They each are really empathetic, and would give anyone the shirt off their back. They make such a good team because, when one is down the other steps up when they need to and vice versa. This relationship a forever combination, if you're lucky to find such a thing. And together it isn't so much each person completes each other, who they are is a reflection of the influence they have on each other. Pisces and Scorpio compatibility, like the saying opposites attract no truer statement applies more to this pair. A Scorpio is cold, and guarded. They struggle in trusting people, and letting anyone in. They always want to be the dominant one in a relationship. A Pisces on the other hand tends to be passive wearing their heart on their sleeve loving a Scorpio, as hard as they possibly can. And while it's a challenge once they have they have a Scorpio's trust, what this bond so strong? Is the loyalty to one another. Pisces and Sagittarius compatibility, emotionally this combination balances each other out very well. They each are hopeless romantics, and wear their heart on their sleeve, and they respect that about each other. They are empathetic, and understanding and truly vibe with what each are feeling, and trying to be what each person needs? In the relationship. The only problem that occurs in this type of relationship is the level of high intense emotions, between the two is sometimes too dramatic, they need someone a little bit different. Pisces and Capricorn compatibility, this pair is one that probably started off as friends first. Each wondering, who was gonna make the first move and when. Any relationship that starts as a friendship you know will be one that's loyal and long-lasting. It's the relationship that comes into one another's lives, when everyone is tired of getting hurt and played. It's the relationship that makes them feel safe and secure. Pisces and Aquarius compatibility, this combination is never one that is boring. This couple goes from one extreme to the other and they struggle to find a normal balance together. A Pisces constantly seeking love, while an Aquarius is naturally distant. And sometimes that works but other times a Pisces struggle with trust issues and that's when the two fight. When you're constantly doubting someone, it's never going to work out. Pisces and Pisces compatibility, the combination of two Pisces is horrifyingly strong, and compatible. They find each other, and each feel like they found their soulmate, or the missing parts of who they need in another person. The relationship takes off almost instant, and that's what scares each of them. And might drive them away from each other. It's finding that person, who is perfect for you but the next question? They each have to ask themselves is are you ready for that sort of thing yet? How to attract a Pisces To attract a Pisces, buy them something meaningful, or make them something that holds merit with them. If you know certain things about them, use that for your gifts. Whenever they use that gift, they will think about you, and they will be reminded of how thoughtful you are. Make them dinner, write them a letter, a Pisces simply just wants to know that you are thinking of them, and that you understand them. How to know if a Pisces likes you? If a Pisces likes you they get very coy, and very silly. They are dreamers, and they will always want to share their craziest fantasies and desires with you. Their awkwardness is often very endearing, and their fits of laughter are a telltale sign that they find you charming. If a Pisces likes you, it will feel like you are in high school again. They will poke you and giggle a lot, and they will approach you in childish ways, sending cute text messages, and flirty comments your way. If a Pisces flirts with you more online versus in person, just know that this is because they are shy, and they tend to withdraw in real life situations. This does not mean that they don't like you, or that they're playing games. They're just more confident online. How Pisces are in a relationship In a relationship, a Pisces is an extreme romantic. They are loving, tender and very generous with their heart. They adore intimacy. They are very deep beings, and therefore they do not waste their time with flings and superficial relationships. A Pisces needs depth, and they need to be appreciated for their sensitivity, and their doting loyalty. They fall in love hard, and they will do absolutely anything for their partners. They are truly the most chivalrous sign of the zodiac, and loving them is a beautiful experience. Ideal date for a Pisces For a Pisces, expression is really important. 
appeal to their creative side and their appreciation of the arts by bringing them to a local art battle, or a place where they can paint, and drink a few beverages. They will love watching you channel your inner creative, and they will feel energized, and inspired in the environment. How Pisces are in the bedroom. A Pisces couple's sex and love. They go hand in hand for these sensitive souls. In bed, a Pisces loves to be emotionally stimulated, complimented and kissed deeply. They need to feel comfortable, and will only open up when they feel secure with their lovers. How Pisces deal with heartbreak. When dealing with heartbreak, a Pisces will often resort to self-pity. They will feel heartbreak in full force, and they will often succumb to their insecurities. They will convince themselves, that they were not good enough, and that they drove their past love away. In order to cope with the intensity of their sadness, a Pisces will isolate themselves, and revel in their dream world, until someone comes along to fill their heart with excitement and hope again. How Pisces are as friends. As a friend, a Pisces is a very compassionate source of love for others. They help anyone in need, and are often taken advantage of, because of how willing they are to stick their neck out for others. Their kind nature is either extremely appreciated, or completely taken for granted. Therefore, Pisces tend to pick a, and d choose friends with a lot of reservation. They may be guarded at first, because they have been so hurt by fake pals in the past. Due to their close-knit choices, a Pisces will stick to childhood friends, who understand their depth. That way they won't have to worry about being hurt, and they will never have to explain their dispositions or their depth. Pisces truly believe in the saying, no new friends. How to gain the respect of a Pisces. To gain the respect of a Pisces, all you have to do is simply be a nice person. They really admire creative types, who are also affectionate and deep. How Pisces are when they're mad. Due to constantly feeling their feelings so deeply, it is difficult for a Pisces to get mad. They often have worked through everything time, and time again, and have been able to experience and feel through whatever it was that angering them. When they do lash out, it is never on others. Rather, a Pisces is known for being very self-destructive, and they will get aggressive with themselves. After an episode, a Pisces will need a lot of time to re-energize their heart, and to feel dreamy again. How Pisces are when they're sad. When sad, a Pisces will suffer from anxiety. They will isolate themselves, and they will feel their sadness, in an extremely intense manner. They will ruminate over the situation that is upsetting them, and they will cry about every bad thing that has ever happened to them, even if those situations are irrelevant to them at that given moment. Simple things that make a Pisces happy. A Pisces loves movies and closeness. Nothing beats cuddling for a Pisces, and they adore being next to someone, who truly gets them. Pisces at their best. At their best, a Pisces is filled with such a beautiful capacity to nurture and feel. They are caretakers, and will do anything to show you that they are there for you. They treat everyone as their equal, and they are cheerful and inspiring people. They are fun, kind, and they will always treat people the way they want to be treated. Pisces often need to be protected, that is how rare and stunning their hearts are. Pisces at their worst. At their worst, a Pisces will take things way too seriously, and they will go to extremes emotionally. They can be reckless, self-destructive, and their need to escape upsetting situations often causes them to isolate themselves, and hide without every taking responsibility for their actions. What Pisces fear the most? To a creative and sensitive Pisces, criticism is a terrible thing. They fear confrontation to the point of needing to run away from it in order to avoid being called out or hurt. They simply cannot handle judgment. Pisces likely occupations. Pisces are old souls. They are creative passionate, and they excel at traditional jobs in the arts. They make amazing musicians, dancers and photographers. Piscians are very intuitive, and when that is added into a creative, service-oriented job, the results are incredible. People really feel understood, and listen to when it comes to being served by a Pisces. Other than that, Piscians would make incredible philanthropists, veterinarians and psychologists, because they foster a lot of compassion within their big hearts. Pisces likely health concerns. Piscians are often associated with the feet and the lymphatic system. A Pisces must allow for ample dreaming time and rest, or else their immune system will grow to be combative and problematic. Where to take a Pisces on vacation? 
A Pisces is quite easily pleased W, when it comes to vacations. All they need is a beach, a comfy place to rest, and an amazing view. An island is always a good idea, because Pisces are known to be water babies. They love being surrounded by the ocean's depths. Pisces learning style. A Pisces learns in both an emotional and sensitive way. They gain their knowledge and their experience through daydreaming. They often need teachers that will be patient with them and seek tutors that create a safe place for their creative thinking. Pisces humor. A Pisces will either tell cute, funny stories or they will be obnoxious with their humor. It is very easy for them to get carried away and spend an hour telling something that loses its comedic appeal very early on. Favorite pastime for a Pisces. A Pisces loves video gaming and listening to music. Their favorite thing to do, however, is to daydream. What to say to motivate your Pisces? You are the most beautiful soul, the perfect balance of sensitivity and mind. You will always get what you want if you simply just focus and trust that you are worthy of success. Keep focusing on the positive. Don't let the world hang heavy on your shoulders. You are allowed to put your load down. You are incredible, and you truly need to see that. You are worthy of so much. Repeat that, and keep on repeating that until you truly believe it.